If you've been living on the planet Earth for the last three months, then you've probably heard of this guy. Lewis Capaldi's career has absolutely skyrocketed in 2019, and that's down to the massive success of his number one album and his hilarious posts all over social media. However, he still claims that he doesn't have much success with the ladies. I haven't known the touch of, a, of anyone in, in quite some time. Quite well acquainted with this little guy, but um, uh, there's still no genital herpes. Now, Lewis might be telling the truth, but I had the pleasure of going to one of his gigs recently, and for a man who'd been described as looking like a potato smiley in the past, the women were trying to climb up the side of the stage like that scene out of World War Z. So I thought the best way to see if he's telling the truth was to create a Lewis Capaldi Tinder profile and see what kind of response we get. So first things first, we've got to make the profile, so let's get straight into it. Just walk out of the pub, I walk out of the boozer like this. The boozer. Walk out of the pub like that. Now the first thing you need to do when creating a Tinder profile is upload some decent pics. And because we're making a Lewis Capaldi profile, there was a shitload to choose from. Then it came to the part that I was absolutely dreading, the about you section. Luckily though, Google's a thing, and I just typed in Lewis Capaldi Tinder bio and it popped up straight away, so that was easy. It reads, Brits Critics Choice nominee. I almost scored top bin once on Soccer AM, not televised. I have one dog and I'm very good at fighting. If that doesn't get the girls swiping right, then I don't know what will. Then you've just got to input your job title and you're pretty much good to go. Even though there was absolutely nothing wrong with any of these girls' faces, there's this little thing called privacy, so I've decided to blur them out. Now, you need to bear in mind that I've literally just made this account. I wasn't actually planning on recording this part of the process, but the results were absolutely mental. This is the point where I ran out of likes on the free Tinder, but because of the crazy success that the profile was having, I thought, sod it, I'll buy some more. After swiping right for half an hour with a little boost button enabled, I'd finally run out of girls to swipe right on. So apparently the boost was a massive success. All I had to do now was give it 24 hours and see if I got any messages. About 50% of the messages just said this is a fake account, and they're absolutely right. But I still managed to convince half the people that messaged me first. And although it didn't convince everyone, at least 139 people swiped right on Lewis Capaldi. And he got 45 messages, all within the first 24 hours of making the account. Not bad for someone who just talks about his arse and his pubes all day. The majority of people just sent him his own song lyrics, whereas some girls just knew exactly the way to unlock Lewis Capaldi's heart. Then we had a girl who just googled his Tinder bio, and that's pretty much exactly what I did. And this girl just did a serious backpedal. I thought I'd go on Twitter and see if anyone was bragging that they just matched with Lewis Capaldi, and I found a few, but this was my favourite, so I went back onto Tinder to try and find a message. And she wasn't lying, she did send me a top class gif. Unfortunately though, it wasn't good news for everyone, so yeah, um, sorry about that. In the end then, I think this proved that Lewis Capaldi's a bit more successful on Tinder than he actually makes out to be. In 24 hours he amounted 139 matches and 45 messages. If you compare that to my friend Andrew who made his account last month, he's matched with 156 girls, but then again he's only got messages from 7 of them. And it's taken 30 times longer. So Lewis, if you're listening, I just want to let you know that we're all really proud of you. Anyway, that's enough from me. Feel free to drop a like down below if you enjoyed the video, and if you want to see more content, remember to subscribe to the channel. And I'll catch you in the next video. See you later. Bye!